Uh, you ready? Yeah. Uh, this is a song called Nocturne, and uh, the lyrics were uh, taken from a Mexican poet named uh, Federico Villarutia, who wrote in Mexico City in the 1930s, and a friend of mine who uh, was on his way to do, uh, to teach in Kabul. Oh, wow. Hit me to the book. That's not him. That's not him. That's Emerson. That's, that's Emerson. <laughs> but we thought we'd have him on this song. So uh, this goes to Adam Klein, who uh, just endured the loss of some friends in a bombing in Kabul yesterday. World's gone mad. Gone. Everything the night would sketch with its shadowy hands, the pleasures it reveals, the vices that it undresses, and everything the shadows make you hear in the heart that in silence, the sudden voices. And the bloody screams that randomly flare And everything The silence makes things emit of desire, the sweat of the earth, the unlabeled perfume of the skin, and everything that desire drags across my lips, the sweet dream of contact, the serious savor of your skin.
you just grab that wrong note, you just hold right on to it Damn until straight. it turns into the right note. <laughs> That's beautiful. <laughs> so this is a song called Hard to See Trouble Coming. And this is about my friend. We're talking about people checking out. Left and right. Um, Joe went uh, two, a year and a half ago. And uh, he was a drummer in my first solo band. And he went at 42. <laughs> and he had uh, severe mental health problems, which is uh, a big problem. And I know a lot of people have really suffered over that. For Joe. Well, I remember you, my Joe, and what it said to me. Tell me, Vic, now, can this world be as sad as it seems? I said, Joe, you will not get an argument from me. It sure seems that way from day to day. But it's last call, Joe. Time for one more drink before we head out on our way. I hadn't seen you mature in years You crossed my mind the other day Cause we were walking past the church Of the Immaculate Conception Once he and I saw a crowd Standing wait For some appearance Of the Blessed Virgin On the wall they said you could see her face well, I didn't see nothing, but Joe said he saw something. But whatever Joe saw, it wasn't remotely the same thing. But it's hard to see trouble coming. Hard to see trouble coming. Hard to see trouble coming. Hard to see trouble coming Will days grow long in the middle of June? Sun is staying up late. It's hot and still like earthquake weather, but I got a feeling I just can't shake. Now Yuma Joe is dead and gone, but I keep on thinking about those days. Most of the time I'm glad I moved on. But sometimes, 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 I wish it nothing had changed. 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 But it's hard to see trouble coming. 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 Yes, yeah, hard to see trouble coming. 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 Thank <laughs> you.
This is a song called Auto Luminescent. This song was written by Roland S. Howard, who's the late, great, uh, now departed like everybody else we're talking about, guitar player for the birthday party, um, uh, Nick Cave's first band. And this song was on, I guess, his second to last solo record. And it's a beautiful song. I think if he heard us play it with an acoustic guitar and a flute, he might roll over in his grave or come back and haunt us so maybe go. maybe he's gonna maybe, he maybe he'll try. spit at us <laughs> throw a lit cigarette at me or something from from the beyond but <laughs> i think uh, we might as well challenge paradigms right <laughs> Auto luminescence. I am white heat. I am heaven sent. I was a nightmare, but I'm not gonna go there again. Black hole, the house of no contest. Make mine a meteor, rise me above the rest. I'm soaring throughout a space. There is no better place. Christ. I'm greater than God in light. I am dangerous. I cut like the sharpest knife. I'm going over and I hope that I can hold you again. on the spiral stairs and I went tumbling down the well I fell on a soft spot I'm white heat and I'm white hot again
again Joys of Brotherhood it was written by Richard Farina in yeah. 1960 something. Yeah, well, six, six, probably seven, within five. a few blocks of here, really. Yeah, you know, um, the great uh, novelist, poet, songwriter, who then dulcimer did, player, dulcimer player, dulcimer player who uh, hit Brian Jones to it. Yeah, and he did a he did this song with his wife Mimi, and then he went out to California in '66. He fell off the back of a Triumph motorcycle in the Carmel oh, yeah. Valley and died. There's so, yeah, still a roadside marker. Wow, I've never seen it. Yeah. Well, you should come to California. I'll take you. We, we, <laughs> we went and found it. There's a little uh, plaque for you. Go rolling by Long The salt sea shine The colors blend And roll as one Often do the winds entwine, descend the distant call, the quiet joy. I hear their fires 
out in the field. They tried, they tried to stir him down. The roses bleed, both light and dark. One thing that you can do for me. There's just one thing that you can do for me. Put that cold coin in my mouth. Put those pennies on my eyes. So I can pay the very man to take me to the other side. Why don't you dance with me? With that cold coin in my mouth Put those pennies on my eyes So I can pay the ferry man He gonna take me to the other side song called My Baby's Brown Hair, and this is a song about my grandfather who ran a pharmacy in St. Louis in the teens and 20s and 30s. He was wiped out in the Depression and uh, kept the pharmacy, and uh, he went from being from playing golf five times a week to selling aspirin for 10 cents a bottle, and uh, he had a, he cheated on my grandmother constantly, and he had a woman who was uh, likely a hooker who he was with off and on for a long time, and he gave her a diamond ring um, as a gift. And she uh, was very hard on her luck in the 30s, like many people were, and she came back and she gave him the diamond ring back for cash. Wow. And so this is the story about that. <laughs> Dang, man. Um, this is family <laughs> history. <laughs> Told from the hooker's point of view. Of course. 
gonna see my old man See if he can fix me up Gonna see my old man See if he can fix me up It's been forever since I've seen him I hate to ask for something now But I got nowhere left to turn And no reason to be proud Gonna see my old man See if he can fix me up Well he sees me when I walk in Put the diamond on the counter and say this should pay my bill. I put that diamond on the counter and say this should pay my bill.
my baby's brown hair Well, it's slowly turning gray My baby's brown hair Well, it's slowly turning gray Well, it turns a little more But still it's less than I can see each day There's not a thing that I can do And there ain't nothing that I would change My baby's brown hair Well, it's slowly turning gray Take us out Attitude most of the time. I like that attitude. <laughs> Pleasure. <laughs> Great. Right. 